go across the Atlantic Ocean to London to our chief international correspondent, Christian Amanpour, who's been taking a look today, Christian, at the reaction of people around the world to what's been happening here in the United States. Judy, even this side of the Atlantic, they're calling it a declaration of war. The newspapers in England and across Europe have been blaring headlines today. Even the normally careful and sedate broadsheets have all got unmistakable commentary. Assault on America, doomsday America, as I say, declaration of war. This is being taken incredibly seriously, as you can imagine here. Uh, commentators have been talking about it for the last two days, and leaders have been stepping up one by one across Europe and indeed across the world, to offer sympathy, solidarity and support. There have been national security meetings in virtually every European capital, in Russia and in other places around the world, and there have been very practical t steps taken, for instance, by NATO. Uh, 19 NATO uh, representatives today in Brussels, in Belgium, their headquarters, uh, invoked uh, a Cold War era treaty in which, essentially, an attack on one member is an attack on all members, and all members are therefore committed to a mutual defense. They have said that this now they have taken. And if the United States decides that it wants to and needs to uh, take action, then NATO is at its disposal to help in that, in that situation. Uh, apart from that, on a human level, there have been many, many people across Europe who've simply come to U.S. embassies, who've put flowers, sometimes even soft toys, who've left messages. Uh, flags have been flying at half-staff at government buildings, certainly in Britain and in other parts of uh, of Europe and around the world. Uh, there have also been uh, many messages of support from uh, Arab countries, particularly the American uh, Arab allies. Uh, they have condemned this act of terrorism and also the uh, 57 nations of the Organization of the Islamic Conference condemn this, saying that this is against